cybersecurity changes every day and it's really exciting. It's not only, it's difficult sometimes because it's not always tangible, you know, you're not building something to a certain degree, but it affects you personally and you can, what you learn in your job, you can take that home. So learn how to better protect myself and my family and my kids. Combining my recruitment background and my passion for cybersecurity, I would say focus on your strengths and play to those strengths. So if your strengths are the softer side and the non-technical skills like in the communications and relationship management, then focus on those core skills and apply that to the cyber securities like cyber awareness, um, strategy. If your skills are in the technical side, then and those are your strengths, then focus on those if you're in like into pen testing or um, security engineering or development, then focus on those to find the right fit for cybersecurity. A lot of job advertisements have a long checklist, so most women, when they see that long checklist, if they can't do everything, then they don't want to apply for it. So I would say have a bit more confidence and own what you know, but also push yourself to try new things and just go for it because that long checklist is very much a unicorn and um, it's very slim chance to find that someone meets all those criteria.